Welcome to the TF Twins fashion vlog. We're here today reviewing the new Twins looks. Uh, the Minnesota Twins unveiling uh, some new uniforms, some new logos, just a general overall rebrand. And here you take a look through across the line. Some things look very familiar, some things look very different. Let's get started with what I like. I really like these cream Twin Cities unis. Uh, some people think they're a little basic with the two color scheme. I think they look clean. I especially like the one color TC logo. I think that looks really sharp. And this sleeve patch with the Millers and the Saints style logos, I really like that. That's really fresh. Uh, I like the homes. The home jerseys in general are good looking. These are the whites with the red script, the numbers on the front, the red numbers in the back. Um, I'm digging the way these look. They, they feel very familiar, you know, nothing too crazy here. Another really nice sleeve patch that I like with the state logo with the star near the Twin Cities. The star's a little Steelers-ish, but uh, here's where they lose me, the, the Rhodes. The pinstripes, that's kind of an interesting new addition, but man, I do not like these hats at all. The M is back, but it's not the M we know. It's not the M we love. Uh, it's not the World Series team's M. It's a new M with a North Star thing going on. Um, I don't know. I don't know if maybe I'll get used to these after a while, but right now they're giving everybody Miami Marlins vibes. Um, and I just don't like them. I, I think that's a pretty common feeling across the fan base. Uh, here are the solid blue tops, which judging by the pants here, it looks like they'll wear either on the road or at home, either or. Uh, these are kind of math to me. Um, I think people are upset. Some other uh, uniforms are going away. And of course, the TC has been changed a little bit. Nothing too crazy there. But in reference to those jerseys going away, I think a lot of people are upset the baby blues are gone. Uh, but pleased that these reds are gone. Personally, I'm not nuts about the baby blues, and so many teams are doing those now. It's not really original or anything. Um, I guess I'd prefer to keep them, but there was actually a somewhat newsy item that came from this unveiling. Doe Young Park of MLB.com reported that Carlos Correa was FaceTiming uh, with Jose Miranda and Jorge Polanco during the event. And sure enough, look in this picture here. Uh, that's Miranda holding his phone in front of Polanco. And sure, yeah, that's definitely Carlos Correa talking to those guys. Um, what does it mean? Maybe not much, but at least it means, you know, it's not complete lip service that he really got connected to the organization and these guys on this team. Um, so that's, you know, a good sign. You know, again, probably nothing too concrete to take away from that, but I think it's better than better than him not being <laughs> interested in all and connected with those guys, I suppose. Anyway, thank you so much to all the channel members. Here are the premium members. Uh, we will talk again soon.